I know a lot of you follow me for my artwork and animations because you either think my art is smooth, and my animations are well done, or maybe you guys just like my ship content I've been doing for a decade. But what if I told you Fallen Ambition used to be bad at animating? Ooh. We all start from somewhere, right? On December 3rd, 2011, I posted my first attempt at animating a fight scene animation with my old invader Zimosis. Back when Flipnote Hatena was relevant on Flipnote Studio, which was a DSi software for easy, simple animation. Back then, I was 14, and I thought my animations were so smooth and well done. <laughs> well, 14-year-old me, who was very naive and dumb, allowed 26-year-old me to look back at this old <clears throat> work of art, as you call it. Make it bend and break. Say a prayer, but let the good times roll. In case God doesn't show. And I want these words to make things right. But if the wrongs that make the words come to life, but who does he think he is? The words you got, but put your fingers back to the <laughs> I was such a blind kid. It was cringe and god-awful. Well, I show this animation off to you guys because I have a small announcement regarding this channel and its future animations. I'll be real here. A lot of my animated content is simple rather than complex. And I'm sure that was already obvious because there are people who critique my work. But if it wasn't obvious, yes, my animations are simple. Simple as in subtle movements, eye blinks, hand gestures, smiling. I can do pretty good lip sync nowadays. That's like about it when it comes to advanced kind of animation. But something I know I don't do is a lot of full body action pose scenes. I have done things like walk cycles before, even run cycles and flight cycles, but things like full body actions as complex as a dance routine animation or a fight and action scene, I've never tried to dive into things like that. But I want to. I've been animating since 2011. Yes, my animation is consistently improving the more tips and tricks I learn and apply to my work, but even to this day, I still tend to shy away from extremely complex animation, simply because I have no idea where to start. It just looks so complex and, I don't know, just watching the hell of a boss scene where they're fighting off the uh, dorks in Truth Seekers, or even seeing Millie kick ass and, um, I don't know how the hell the team does that, but, you know... We all start from somewhere, as I've said, like, two other times. That all changes now. And I know just where to start. I'm gonna be redoing the animation that I showed in the beginning of this video. That animation was done in December of 2011, and it was of my Invader Zimosis, Dot and Amy. It was just some random fight song and a fight animation I thought was cool back then. Boy, was I wrong. But yeah, instead of this animation being redone with those Invader Zimosis, the redo is going to be done with Blitz fighting my OC Remy's dad, Zalan, and ending with Zalan dying, essentially, because he's a horrible dad and caused a lot of pain in Remy's childhood and life. And the song, Thanks for the Memories, just fits as like a fight song. I don't really know too many other fight songs that I could use. Figured that one would be pretty good. I will be aware that this will be very challenging for me, as I am not a professional animator. I know there's a lot of people who look up to me and have gotten inspiration from me to try to start animation, and that does warm my heart to see that there are people who want to learn and that I've inspired them to animate because I didn't go to school. I, I didn't have the money. I I could not afford to go to school. And even to this day, I really don't think going to animation school to learn how to properly do consistent, like, professional animation because I've gotten far on my own without any struggles. Animation was something I just picked up. It's not really something that I want to honestly pursue as a job. I just do it for fun and hope that people enjoy what I love doing, you know? A lot of people critique me saying, hey, you should do this, 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 and that for your animations. Don't do this, 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 and that. 
I don't usually like looking for critiques because I'm not a professional. I'm not really looking to improve too, too much. I'm mostly doing animation for fun and I don't really care how it looks. I, I'm just having fun. But the thing that gets me is I've always wanted to animate fight scenes and stuff. And back when I was 14, you know, animation was something I learned to do and Flipnote Studio was free access to the public with anyone that had a DSi growing up and th that's where I started. Once Hatena shut down in 2013, like the whole community of Hatena fucking collapsed and we all just like animated apocalyptic animations because it was like the Hatena apocalypse type thing because the whole place went down to shit. But even after Hatena shut down, I mean, I've learned to do everything I do all on my own without any teacher to teach me. I, I teach myself, I'm self-taught. And I mean, it just takes me continuously drawing and animating every day of my life since I was young. I am currently looking to improve further. I am very determined. I chose the name Fallen Ambition for my artist's social media handle because there, there are times where I will fall and the world may scream at me to give up and accept failure, but you know, I've, I've never been the type to just give up and lay there in defeat. I'm determined. So because I'm determined, I just so happen to have enough determination to just get back up and be just as ambitious and thrive to learn how to better my animations. And I need to step out of my comfort zone eventually. Why I chose a fight scene specifically is because of my web series I'm making. My series, Elementals of Sekiri, is a series that literally revolves around magic and a lot of fight scenes with combat magic. And there's just so many fight scenes I have in my mind for this series. Yeah, I do have a small team of animators and storyboards right now, but even if I didn't, whether I did or not, I would still have to had come out of my comfort zone eventually and animate fight scenes without half-assing it because uh, yeah, there are times where sometimes I just don't want to animate or put my all into it because I don't care if it looks good. But if I'm going to be making my own web series, I kind of can't be doing that. I've got to give it my all. So with that out of the way, I appreciate you guys for coming this far and watching. And I thank you for all the support. Expect some potential rough storyboard posting of my first ever fight scene animation within this month or in a few months. I'm not sure when. I have a lot on my plate right now. But yeah, thank you. So hypnotizing Could you be the devil? Could you be an angel? Your touch magnetizing Feels like I am floating Leaves my body glowing Rena, are you guys keeping secrets from me or anything? Of course not, T.A.T. Why would you think that? You're lying right now, aren't you? And how do we know you're not lying, T.A.T.? Don't change the subject. When you went to the bathroom, Kichi, you never went to the bathroom, did you? I know you did it because I followed you. Why did you follow me to the bathroom? Silence, fool. I saw you sitting in the police car talking with that man. You know how I know this? Because I was that man! face. Do not eat my f You ate his face? I'm not cute. I'm
I cannot believe my eyes How the world's filled with filth and lies But it's plain to see Evil inside of me Is on the rise Look around We're living with the lost and found just when you feel you've almost drowned You find yourself on solid ground And you believe there's good in everybody's heart Keep it safe and sound With hope you can do your part To turn a life around I cannot believe my eyes Is the world finally growing wide? Cause it seems to me some kind of harmony is on the rise. Anyone with Take half a slow, brain he looks could spend their whole life howling in pain. The things that I'm Cause the dark is everywhere and Annie doesn't seem to care that soon the dark in me is all that will remain. Listen close to in everybody's heart And hear that breaking sound Hopes and dreams are shattering apart And crashing to the ground I cannot believe my eyes How the world's finally growth and wise But it's plain to and see And it's plain to see Evil inside of me, inside of me. Is on the rise. Hey, 
Hey, how y'all? Get your fucking dog, bitch! It don't bite. Yes, it don't bite. Fucking talk about the embarrassing shit with the dumpster to people you introduce me to? Shut the fuck up, Rem. It was fucking hilarious. <sighs> to you! You're telling me if you saw Moxie in a dumpster digging around, you wouldn't be laughing at that fucking sight? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right, bitch. Fucking hilarious. <sighs> Bite me, bitch! Careful what you fucking wish for, I just might, you little shit. Why do we have to have this powder puff involved in our shit? Powder puff? Cool it, Remy. You know how I feel about being monogamous. That shit's boring. Plus, Tizzy here likes ya. <sighs> fine. Um, actually, it's, um, Tiziri. I'll just call you Honey Bun since you hop like a rabbit, and that hood you always wear makes that fitting. I... Um, uh, uh, already then. <laughs> Kitten and honey bun. That shit has a nice ring to it. Oh well, welcome to the relationship, bitch. Let me feel, feel your love. 